you cheeky. Hey, Miss Constructed. How are you? Not late. Just woke up, so. Oh! How are you? Hmm? Oh, yeah, bad boy. What? I. I don't know much on that. I just got back from trying to chase down Adelaide Winners. <laughs> you just tried to chase her down. She knows that she's wanted. I asked her to come in. Told her what she was in, and she just ran for a horse. Fought out on the plains, fired a warning shot in the air. A horse went over a bluff, and she went down with it. But uh, I couldn't find her. So she must have pulled herself out or got snagged on a rock and run away. And then I saw a horse again in town, so I was looking around town. Couldn't find her. I was going to ask if you saw what she was waiting for. I did. But now I'm thinking she's one might be wanted for something else after fleeing and looting and failure to you know, comply. But uh, she certainly she didn't was know stuffing. that she was wanted last night. She, I mean, yeah, she wasn't she, until I heard all that. She was stuffing something in her saddlebags, really quick. She really didn't want me to see it. She refused to get searched, and that's why she ran actually. Hmm. And she said she was on her way to Thieves' Landing to work at the speakeasy there. It was a new job and she couldn't be late. Well, she's probably selling moonshine down there. Yep. Probably. A lot of it from how she was stuffing in the saddlebags. Hmm. Yep. Uh, that's about it, though. Been pretty quiet otherwise. No bank robberies, no uh, strange folk running through town. How about yourself? You doing alright? A wee bit wanting to go down to roads now. Uh, I can ride with you there. Something bank roof jumper. Yeah. I met that fella. He's just insane. He thinks that uh, the ground is death and destruction. And he prefers to live on rooftops. Okay. Well, sure. If you, if you don't mind going down to roads, I just... Yeah, that's all. Go on. Hopefully gonna go attend that train in tomorrow. Did you go to it today? I didn't get a chance to know. Right. I won't be able to get a chance to tomorrow either. Oh that's a shame. They just at awkward times for me. Mm-hmm. Hold on, I think I just saw Adelaide. Not her. <sighs> I'm not gonna be able to use my long arm. <sighs> How's the arm healing then? Not well. 
Um, I mean, I got shot last night. Did you hear what happened? I didn't hear you got shot last night. No way. Uh, we're coming here into Blackwater. We're over on the other side of the river. There's a pack of wolves. I say, don't shoot me. Guess what happens? You're kidding me. No, I'm not kidding you. Good lord. Triggering discipline. Whoa, Raider! Right okay. Okay. No, and it's been several times because I'm often leading patrols because no one knows their way around the state, apparently. I. Uh, when wolves come up, I'm often the one that they go for, and then I'm screaming at the deputies not to not to shoot me. I'd rather take my chance with the wolves on my own than have five deputies shooting around me or right over my head or right at me to get the wolves. It's sort of infuriating. The other day, I was literally scrambling up on top of a rock, and the bullets were hitting right where my heels had been moments before. I've noticed, and this ain't a criticism so much as an observation fact that a lot of the new cadets do not know how to travel around the person. Yeah, I, I've noticed that too. They also can't shoot worth a damn. They're kind of about shooting. I mean, I'm not claiming to be the best shot, you know. I but know I know him more this. than to, to shoot next to other deputies. Unless, you know, I really know. <laughs> I, 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 I don't know. I, Emergency is only, and I don't think that wolves are really that much of an emergency. Yeah, They're I don't bad. Think I'm a marksman either, but at the same time, I can generally hit what I'm shooting at. Why? I mean, same. I guess that's why the cadets are training still. I'm gonna speed up. Yeah, alright. I'm following you. Sorry, I forget what the difference is between the Turkmen's and those, uh, those cubs. Cubs. Yeah, no, I can keep going. That's actually how I was able to catch uh, Adelaide. I outlasted her. Well, my horse wasn't really tired at all there. I just, you were no, so far behind. No. Smudge is a bit slow, but she can go for a while. I wouldn't say that Besides, Burtz has a plan for Boyd. Most He's times I ain't even in chases. I'm just hauling people around. <laughs> That's always my uh, strategy with, with chases, though, is you, you outlast them. You take it easy. And you let them burden their horses out in the panic. They'll usually do it. Yeah, just a good case in point there. Adelaide, uh, her horse was exhausted by the time she hit the edge of town because she was pushing it in town. Mate, right. all oh, that's what she did when uh, I chased her outside of uh, Sandini. She burned her horse out. I just had to keep an eye on her where she was. I 
I'm just surprised she managed to survive a horse falling on top of her. <laughs> it's pinned or anything. I just still can't even believe that I heard that entire conversation last night. Yeah, that was a bit absurd. What did you ever do to her? <laughs> uh, Dinah Khan searched the crossing for hours on end to find her when she was kidnapped. Uh, was kind to her, talked her out of no dangerous situations, and then arrested her friends for vigilantism. So. Well, heaven forbid. Oh, and you I did. I friends, did. Therefore, you must be evil. I arrested her too after uh, Dolly Dixon's murder and bank job that she was involved in. Right. And so she went away for that. I wasn't the one who was, you know, writing up her charges or anything. I just brought her, got her in the cells. But boy, it was essentially so. How much to kill a deputy? Uh, and then he goes, Ah, uh, then I can. How, how you got in mind and she goes that's saffron I hate her she's everywhere and I can tell you I wanted to step out from behind that door so badly right in that moment <laughs> that would have been ex Honestly, I mean they probably would have wet their pants but the thing is I was the only deputy in town at the moment so I couldn't uh, risk getting to a confrontation with the both of them you could have just shouted at the walkthrough and she ran away I guess uh, it was, you, you know the general store and 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 uh, Blackwater, they were meeting yeah. under the lamplight right right outside the back door. So I, when I saw them there, I wondered if I could hear them if I went inside and just sat next to the back door. And I, I could hear them very, very clearly. Oh, hell. I did it when Pete wondered if he had suspected that I was listening because uh, suddenly uh, she dropped her voice and I couldn't hear her anymore, but I could still hear fish, so... You thank God for fish being an idiot. <laughs> for the most part, though, I heard I heard both of them. So, Those horses are already lined up. Three pins. Just, uh, I'm just checking this first, uh, first suture is held. Seth, I got shot. Oh, yeah, I heard. I got shot. He's fine. <sighs> That's right. At least he got shot Fuck. by the bad guys, right? I got shot by our own people last night. Yeah, I read that. What happened? Who shot you? It, it doesn't really matter. Just people go too crazy when there's wolves involved. And screaming at people not to shoot me all week because I'm usually leading patrols and so the wolves go go after me so I nearly get shot. Can you search them Except for last night it wasn't nearly. Sure uh, what's it? Like my spleen, Seth, my spleen. Their weapons uh, are taken yourself? from them already. Uh, all right. Please tell yeah. me you're... How badly, how badly are you shot? Right you need people it's all right. I just advise not to be able to travel along really. right now. <sighs> or just in well, general. But... I'm on morphine. It looks like the training's over. Briar, McGregor, Buckley, so Ivy, and Thorne are going to Blackwater. And then they instantly oh. Weller, guns and Weller, us. Blair. Who is it? Sorry? It, Weller, Kramer, uh, Riley, and Sanks are going here. I got, I got shot before okay. I knew so, the fuck was going right. on. First we don't have count. anyone going to Valentine right one? now. I can go there first for that. <sighs> yeah. Stay um, there until people come. Yeah, we need a few people to go to Valentine just because there's no one there right now. Mm hmm. Right, well, I mean, uh, I can go. I just uh, can't use long arm today. Okay, well, it is. I think it's quiet up there anyway, there. so. Who'd you learn from? It's just to keep this the peace here, honestly. Uh, right now, there's no one there. Um. Um. My, uh, yeah, my teacher was, was uh, Dr. Sending Amelia people to Valentine. She <laughs> was uh, um, an army medic yeah, right. for uh, for a number of years before heading for oh, there. Oh, head on back here then. She, she taught me. All right, it's held. Right, I, I so that's done with that. So cat gun. Need, need help at Valentine? I can go. 
It's up to you, Sheriff. The silk needle is prepared. Have you still got a hold of it? Correct. Yes, I do. All right. Sheriff. Sorry. Just hang Do you want me to go to Valentine too, so I can go? No, no, you're fine. You stay here. You, you're not fucking... Uh, I'm, I'm okay. Life. I'm okay for duty. Can you take it easy, Boyd? I just won't use my side arm. All right. I'll get it washed down. I'll be my, my long arm. <laughs> Where is my side arm? Like I just gotta take smudge the stable real quick. Are you sure? I love this hat, but I just don't like the way the hat looks with the long hair. I wish I could just switch between the hairstyles really easy without having to go to the bank. Or not the bank, the barber. It drives me crazy that I have to go to the barber to put my hair up or let it down. A little bit native. Kramer and Weller are going to come with us. They just need to talk to Kramer real quick. All right. Got everything, uh, every, everything go here. We got something to tell you. Uh, then I kind of just woke up, so yeah, I don't really know. Yeah, just got in. You want to talk to me? Uh, Beckwith, were you here for the, uh, the nope. uh, shooting? I've been in Blackwater all night. Gotcha. Okay. Been dealing with uh, Edwin Braithwaite coming up and just punching me in the face. Oh. Lovely. Wait, really? Why? Hey, she wanted to t he wanted to turn himself in, so he just walked on up, Hi. fired in the air six times, punched me in the face. The, uh, yep. <laughs> then I had just got on duty, and that was very shocking. As soon as I walk out of here, six gunshots. I turn around and then there's Edwin Braithwaite who walks up. He's like, "Hello." I'm like, "Howdy." And he punches me in the face and like, "I want to turn myself in." I like, really hope that you right. charged him for that assault and battery on the LEO on unlawful discharge. Uh, nah, I didn't. At the end, uh, he returned Ed's gun. Mm. So figured that's worth it. Besides, he hits like a wet noodle. Okay. Down in uh, who be flying it? Uh, Blackwater, six strong. Uh, me, Kramer, Rip, and Sankum are going to head to Valentine if you folks wish to accompany. Sure. There's a group of six dying in Blackwater of deputies? I think it was a group yeah. of five. Yeah. Um, huh. it, yeah, a group of five. Yeah, it was either yeah, five. We or just six. finished training, so they got sent down there. Mm -hmm. Alright, must have just missed them. Hey, Mitchell, I rested up uh, Forrest this morning. You were absolutely certain that was him, right? Uh, aye? Why? Okay, good. Oh, he was just protesting innocence. Yeah, they, they protest everything. No, no I know, I know. I was just making, I was just making sure. That's all. No, 100%. Did you, did you yeah. let him know I, that I, I heard him saying it? No, no, why would I? Fuck no. I put the note, I put the note up saying... Source. Uh, 
Oh, oh no, I specifically want him to know that I did. I'm stay on roads. Bummer. All right, uh, take there's a, a lot of folk. <laughs> but who knows, maybe now he'll think that Daddy? that Adelie sold him out or something. <laughs> well, yeah. it, interestingly enough, right, so he actually was talking to Adelaide uh, about a week ago about the murder of Dolly. And Adelaide lied to his face and said that she didn't do it, and I informed him that he did, so... I don't think he'll be doing any favours for her anytime soon. No, but it was it was so unmistakably Forrest and Natalie. I... That was Monroe. Uh, we're back with Go. Ah, uh, he was straight with us. Are we not going to wait for him? Yeah, we'll wait. Ideally. Here he's coming. I don't know if he said anything. But all right, there we go. I wanted to know where everyone was, so I had to give him the rundown. I see. Alright, yeah, just one, two, two, one, stay in the formation. You know, it's a good problem when we have too many deputies to station six of the town. Yeah. That is true. Yeah, I know. How good is this, right? How many are on the. Uh, we actually have to right move now? spaces because there's too many of us, and that's just in general. I don't think yeah. we've ever had that issue. Well, I really think that nope. they should start having deputies mean stay mainly where they're stationed. Well, yeah, that's absolutely. usually what we. I, I tried to stick near Valentine. We just got told to go to roads. That's what I mean. I've, I've been hanging around Valentine for weeks now. No, I, 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 I typically, I typically stay in Blackwater because I'm West Elizabeth. You know. Yeah, I well, think like everyone stay. typically does it. Just still has to move around. Someone's needed somewhere, but. Uh, yeah, I know when we uh, it'd, be nice, it'd be nice if the sheriffs could just morning. sort of see who's on duty for each uh, each county. And then if they have to move yeah. people around to balance it out, they would just give them their assignment for the day. See, hey, I need you to go over. Hey, Par uh, Lucille. Hey. Appreciate that. Oh, that, that way, hey, you wouldn't have you happy. wouldn't have people riding from the moon to handle a, a, a bank job and, yeah, and West Elizabeth and then everyone showing up there at wins. Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah. Well, that, that could, the same could be just done with general check-ins as well. Yeah, Why, but no one likes to, no one, no one checks so it. Yeah. I'm trying to get a lot I'm, better at it. Yeah, we're, we're, we're going pretty good at it. Aye, but sometimes, I'll, if I'm on my you know, own, I clock I on sure and there's 14 lawn and there's nothing on the tip lane to indicate where they are. I think honestly, if it's worth it, like maybe every hour, just check in your location if you can. Like if you're if you've been sitting in a town for two hours, just make sure people know that you're still in that town by just saying you know stationed here. Nice. I agree. It's easy enough to be done. You just got to keep reminding the people around you until it becomes habit. Yeah. Look, once this new filing system comes in, oh boy, I'm sure everything will be a bit. No, I am sure it will fix a lot of the communication issues. Can't wait to retire to my chair in Valentine and do paperwork. <laughs> Aren't you stay that sounds West awful. Elizabeth. That is such a strange desire to have uh, back I, I go between West Elizabeth and Valentine. What do you say? I, mean, yeah. I, I respect it. He just, he's excited. All he wants to do is sit in the office in Valentine and do paperwork. Oh, well, actually, oh, Mitchell, yeah, you and me got to put paperwork. our heads together and, uh, what is it? Build these, uh, case against old mate Hugo, uh, Thine, and that other fella. Right. Oh, I, Going right. I know, I need to look at that. Yeah, if you want to, we could smash it out in like 20 minutes, I reckon. Sure, if you've got more information. Uh, well, yeah, well, we're going to charge them for that road shootout. Because <laughs> they weren't charged. Oh, I, okay, I, we need to, we need, good thing, we need to, get, I, I want to, I want to actually be able to put uh, fine away for a while. Because uh -huh. these, these yep. you know, an occasional kidnapping here and, you know, a stalking charge here Torturing. is nothing. Yep. Uh, it doesn't yep. put them away. Plus, we well now with that incident in Rhodes, you know we can get them with a uh, gang violence uh, participation. Aye. Honestly, so, we should have got them with that before. Who, who's who, here's a question, right? So if there, if a shootout happens, right? Right. But you try and rush someone mouse. with a knife, is that still participation in a shootout? I, 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 right? I they're still participating in, in the shoot, yeah. I, whether or not they uh, resort to a knife yeah. or not. Even if all you're trying to do is uh, distract people in the shootout. Mm -hmm. And you can get them for the gang violence and for participation yep. in a shootout, so we should make sure right. to write up the charges to reflect that. Yeah, once we get there, we can 
I'll get into that Rhodes incident and we will uh Sorry, it's it's just it's just also it hard, you know, because I'm doing this right to to save Adelie from getting forced into marriage by a, a psychopath, eh? And then the she's same woman who's and then she's around. like, Oh, I need you to to uh, teach Saffron a lesson and kill her uh, for me. So Oh, oh these folks don't know where they're going. Uh would they wear masks? I couldn't I'm, tell. They're outside of town. They they, I mean, you think they were? I think they were. It did, and then they're bucking it. Either they incredibly now. shaky hair. We have See, gotten reports when they of wear two all black women and have dark hair. It's like, are they wearing a mask? There was a report earlier of two women with a description like that going and robbing out outside of Emerald yep. Ranch. Ooh. If everybody wears all black, are you gonna differentiate? Mm-hmm. That's, yeah, that's why they did. God damn it, Kramer. I, he's slowed up really fast. I got another yeah, one. Yeah, I know. I, I blame Kavanaugh. You're right. I've never done anything wrong. I'm perfect. <laughs> just a perfect I'm sure. boy. So we just we just did that training, right? Ah. Uh, we, we beat him twice. Shat all over them. And oh. man, Monroe was unimpressed with us kicking. Okay. Even though it's Rip just because he was on the other team. That's why. Times. Hopefully, I'll be able to go to training soon. tomorrow. I also it was, had it was people good trying to strangle me. What time is the training? No, you just got handcuffed. At 10 p.m. Ooh, I was talking about the yeah, if, if you like, if you I, I plan today, on going to it tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I was I trying to go to both, but it is what it is. Alright, I'm uh, gonna immediately be leaving here to go to Blackwater. Um, my, mm, I'll go with you to Blackwater, because... Uh, Weller, Rip, what are you doing? Weller? Yes? Are you going to stay here, or are you okay with going down to Blackwater? Uh, I... There'll, there'll be six deputies or five deputies in Blackwater. So oh, there's already yeah. a bunch of deputies. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I guess I'll stay yeah, in this cursed town. No, I hate this town. Yeah, I hate yeah, this yeah. town oh, so much. Fine. I'm it's quiet. Uh, <laughs> I don't care how quiet it is. You can't. You can't take two steps without being covered in mud. And what's this? Yeah, you got Maple, Thorn, McGregor, Buckley, and Ivy all in Blackwater. I'm. I'm gonna go send the. Okay. All right. Uh huh. Okay. Tell me who's staying. Is it all of us besides Kavanaugh? Rip staying, Weller staying, I'm staying, Mitchell, you're staying. I guess so. I, I'm asking. You don't have to. I'm I know I have, have to. to. Okay. Wow. Beckwith, you're staying. Okay, so Beckwith, Mitchell, Weller, Rip. Is Kavanaugh left already? What's that? Oh, wait, what is that? Not that we're gonna have to go anywhere because we're. It's From where? Oh, Fuck that. Are you really itching to get out of town? I hate this town. Why? why? It's quiet right now. It's disgusting. Now. I hate this town. I can't even take two steps wow. without getting covered in mud, and I can't even visit the bathhouse because people there want to murder me. Moonshine is heading east from uh, West Elizabeth. Oh, see, that's actually a decent one to go after. <sighs> no, you weren't. No, you weren't. You're on drugs, right? Are you I don't want to hear Are we going to try and go out there to look for the Shiners? Yeah, we're, we're going to go look for the Shiners, yeah. Oh, how, how many of us? I mean, I can look Oh, yeah, here. actually, tell you what, Mitchell, as annoying as it is, why don't these three go for the Shiner? You and me can get okay. the fucking thigh and things okay. sorted. Alright, then okay. why don't you send know, an update? Nah. Yeah. Well, you send an update then. <laughs> yes, okay. Alright. Alright. Are you coming back to Valentine right. after? I don't know. I don't know where the shot. Is. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah. Yes. But you're coming back. Yep. Yes. All right. What did the tip say? Where are we going? West Elizabeth heading east. I. So it's it's either going it's either going to Lumwine or it's going up to Cattail Point. So think about where they'd have to go. All right. We're either going to Bards or we're going by Strawberry. Why don't you choose one to gamble? Cattail. Up towards Actually, Wallace. Up Let's towards go. Wallace. It, yes. Yes, exactly. Towards Wallace. Hey. Uh, hey. Um. I. I believe there was a deputy that wanted to talk to me. By the name of Deputy Dusk. She around. Uh she was in Rhodes last I saw. She's still there. I, I mean I I can't imagine that she might be. 
but she was I just came from Rhodes to Valentine. She was there when I was there. Mm. You could always right. try reaching out to Ina and saying that you're looking for her, see if she'll get back. To no, you. no, no. I just, I just figured that she was over there or something. No, no, she's not. She didn't come to town with us. All right. No, she has a question for me from some shit about a month ago, apparently. So. All right. I'm afraid I'm not familiar with whatever she wants. Yeah, they're fine. They're fine. They're fine. They're fine. All right. Thank you. Bye. A lot of people in the SD station. What does that even mean? Oh, a donut. Where'd Waller go? <laughs> Hi. Uh, Just hey, checking to see if any lol is in town. Uh, I'm law and I'm in town. I can help oh. you. Good. Oh, no, we don't, don't need any help. You, not now. No? Wait, you think that there's, you're going to need help? Oh, no. Hopefully not. Hopefully things stay quiet like it is. I... I, I, I was just... Huh? No, no, I... Okay. <laughs> Sorry, uh... Just in case, I was just making sure someone, somebody was here. Are you concerned that something's about to happen? Uh, I don't want to jinx anything. Just a feeling. You know when it gets quiet? something happens so sometimes some yes sometimes my name is dr mitchell uh who do i have the pleasure of speaking with today oh angel ortega i work at the bathhouse angel ortega you, yeah you work at the bathhouse for is that for tommy t snakes and everyone uh yeah well or or uh mama christine she hasn't been around for a while she Oh, guess what? She just came back today. Oh, how wonderful. And she's a lot better. Hmm. Yeah, she was walking around. She has some new clothes. Yeah, she looks great. Good to hear. Yeah. Well, hopefully, hopefully things go well for her. Uh-huh. Uh, 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 huh? Oh, what, you, uh, you, you have some doubt about it? Uh, didn't he say anything about it? Oh, okay. All right. Well, I better get back to my, uh, to my partner working with me. Right. I'm sure you need to go a what? Do something bath like over there or something. Oh, a customer. Oh, well, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, oh, yeah. Well, we fulfill our customers. Uh huh. Request. Oh, uh, your name again is uh, Mitchell? Deputy Mitchell. No. Uh, da Daphne? Deputy. Yeah. Da oh, Mitchell. Deputy Mitchell. Oh, nice meeting you. Hi. Uh, same. Angel Ortega was Angel Ortega. Yes, that's my name. Well, they keep telling me, they keep asking me, have I ever met a deputy Ortega? I never met him. There's a Marshal Ortega. A He's Marshal. Not around very much. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'd like to meet him. But everybody says what you said. He's not around much. Mm-hmm. Marshals are busy. Their job takes them out of state off. Oh, yeah, I would imagine. Yeah, well, nice meeting you. I better get back to work. All right, take care. Oh, 
Oh, Joy, another one of the drones down at the bathhouse. What? I said, oh, Joy, oh, he's yeah, another one of the drones down at the bathhouse. And yeah, apparently Christine's yeah. back in town. Amazing. Mm hmm He came up here being all creepy. I asked him what he was doing. Then he started making an awkward conversation. Yeah, I was in half a mind that he was about to try and blow your brains out right there and then until I rolled up, so I couldn't see that wasn't the case. <sighs> Tess Valkyrie, thank you so much for the gift of Look, I'm to awfully Zebra. suspicious of fucking almost everyone since I've had threats made by Scout, Tommy the Wrestle. Oh, People either love me or severely me hate me. It's amazing. Oh, nothing like the comical, like, I'm going to get you sense. I mean, Flash does that all the time. See, I, like, see, 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 like, see the difference is I've, I've got no doubt that the bathhouse crew would try and get me in a heartbeat if I had the opportunity. Oh, yeah. They hate my guts. They've tried, they've, tried, they've tried to murder me before. Oh, Jesus. You didn't hear about that? It was before I was even zapped at you, Waller. Uh, no, I, I didn't. I uh, heard some... Uh, the one thing that I can see is they have some kind of fascination with you and Bridges. Aye, because that's what they did. They threw me off a Bacchus Bridge. Jesus Christ. Lucky to be alive. I bet. That's well, why I'm they talk about it, because they think they've got some thing over me. I, I just tell them to get fucked. But that's me. Look, I, I apologize. Uh, um, was it the wanted... Um, I'm... oh yeah, I'm I'm an idiot. Sorry, I didn't read the note. It was kind of like a weird thing because he we started talking about information potentially leading to summers and whatnot. Um, but I definitely informed them in quite a uh, aggressive manner that if they think of doing anything to a deputy, that hell hath no fury, basically. I said, please inform them that Deputy Mitchell overheard their ridiculous plot, and I thought they'd be lucky that they're not being charged for conspiracy to commit murder. Yeah, see, the only thing is I, I didn't want to s exactly single you out, so I see, do apologize. No, I did, I, I, I I did cash, say Cash that... recommended, you know, let them know that you heard it <laughs> and stuff. Right. <laughs> so, I mean, they're already tar wanting to target me, right? So what's gonna, was it going to change? Well, my thought process was really fuck up his relationship with Adelaide. Right, because I made it sound like if Adelaide, you know... I literally said to him, if Adelaide, if I bring Adelaide in here for the same thing, is she going to say that there was no conversation whatsoever? And I said, if you lie to me now, then you'd be breaking any trust I might have for you in the future. To which he responded, no, she wouldn't. So once I drag her in here and she gets the same thing, as soon as she spills the beans on the conversation, any future encounter I have with Forrest is, I'm not going to be usually my friendly self. Well, back with, back with Trey to arrest Adelaide and she fled from him and town and apparently crashed her horse off a embankment and disappeared so we know where she is hopefully the wolves are getting her but i mean i know for the fact it was him and her i i saw them both and then i walked around and i listened to the conversation all right forrest was doing Let's... all creepy stuff where he talked about his guppy gang and, and, and the fish people yep. named something fish Brickfish, really, scarfish, yeah, just, just really shit. creepy, weird stuff. Yep, okay. So, what have we got on that Tommy shootout versus Thorn? Tyne? Thine or Thorn? Uh, t Tyne, sorry. That's fucking too many names sounded similar. <laughs> I need that. Uh, I, I put an investigation for Dr. Roger Tyne. Uh, I've here we go, here we go. Kidnapping. Yep, amazing. And I've got, oh, uh, DNA wanted Dr. Roger Tyne. Okay. All right. Let's see. Can you uh, pull those to the top for me, please? Aye. Yep. Well, I found the... the Two snakes shoot, shooting two. Yep, so I, I got that. Okay. I just, I, I've copied it all. I just need to put this note, which I just wrote it on. Yeah, perfect. Okay. So incident one. So yeah, you got kidnapping, torture, and stalking. Awesome. 
And then I'll add incident two here, which will be the road shootout. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Are you guys busy? No, not at all. What can we help you with? Okay. What? Ma'am? She knows I said not at all. Miss, she said he, er, he said that we're not. Um, Ma'am, we can talk yeah, no, to you. I, I said not at all. What can we help you with? I was like, not sure what you guys were, were saying. If you're not busy or not. No, no, we're not busy. How can we help? Uh, hello, my name is Oksana. I'm relatively new to the crossing, but um, I was uh trying to figure out how to get uh, a more improved bow. If you guys oh, know how. I do know. Yeah, you just uh. My suggestion is, there's a few folks, uh, I believe Mato is a, a part of the uh Yes, I, I keep hearing his name every time I ask about, you know, the, the whole bow Correct. situation. He's a, he's a, yeah, part of the Wapiti, Wapiti tribe who reside up in the camp uh, just north of here, I believe it is. Mm -hmm. Almost northeast. Um, All right. They do have a bow maker there. I unfortunately have forgotten his name. Um... You could obviously uh, approach Mato about getting one made for you, especially if you want really nice craftsmanship. But most of the supplies, uh, like tomahawks and bows and arrows and things like that, at least better ones you can find up there as well. I would always highly suggest uh, talking to some of those folk before you go up there. Uh, but, you know, they're friendly is it, folk. They is, it it. Sa is it a, is a sacred ground or something? I'm not educated enough to talk about that matter. I don't believe mm. so, though. They get visitors. You know, we've been up there before and things like that. But, you know, it's always good if you're... Uh, especially if you're going to be hunting around, you know, maybe Big Valley or some other areas and things like that. Just, just to stop it, and say just hi. Just find them, talk to them, and they'll help you get a bull. All right. Do you know how much it's going to cost? Uh, I, can't, I think they're around $50 or something. So, like what, what was your name, sorry? Oksana. 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 Beautiful name. Where are you from? I'm from Russia. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Here, take this. Oh. My hands are a bit slippery. There, that should oh, cover wow. the cost okay. of the bow. And uh, my suggestion, if, if you're going hunting out on your own, uh -huh. uh, maybe approach Mato or some of the other natives, maybe about uh, uh, learning how to use a tomahawk would be my suggestion. Because if you're out hunting alone, a bear comes charging at you. Yeah. Right, You'll be yes. feeling that thing like a pin cushion, but one swift tomahawk to the skull usually uh, does the best idea. Just don't use them on other people. So obsessed. Look, I'm just, I'm just saying. You're getting charged by a bear. You can fucking oh, fire as I many mean, arrows as I, you want. I used to wrestle bears when I was in Russia, so bears don't really scare me. Okay, well, if you it's come more in so with any bear people. wounds, I will be standing over you saying, I told you so. I'm just letting you know that. Well, alrighty then. I, <laughs> I will make sure of that. But um, you're you're very kind. Thank you for that information. No, no worries. Uh, but yeah, definitely, you know, if, if especially even if you just want to know good hunting grounds and stuff, reach out to Mato and those folk. They're, they're good folk. Alright. I and mean, can I... Crossing. Oh, thank you very much. I, I appreciate it. Um, do I just go and uh, just, you know, yeah, can I just absolutely. go there? And yep, you can. Yeah, feel there's, it out there's myself? nothing stopping you. Yep, there's okay. nothing stopping you. Oh, there seems always, you know, to be a body. You uh, grab the cylinder. Right. Well, thank you. That... One GSW to the shoulder. Ooh, and he's got a mask on. Where Where'd this come from? Uh, the moonshine uh, up at Cattail. Uh, oh, wow. They went on a chase to give him warning. Uh, they fell off at the track. He proceeded to run under the track, try to get on the horse. I shot the horse, but yeah. Uh, wow. Okay. Yeah. And a thrilling moonshine chase. All right. His wounds have been packed. He just needs a. Uh, All right. I'll send a telegram in for medical. Sand baths. <sighs> Imagine. <laughs> no, it's not. I don't think so. I don't think Weller was chasing new woman. Think he was just being friendly.
Anyway, looks like you didn't have the best of times. <laughs> Again, unconscious. Because Marnie told him not to. We're getting medical for this fella, right? Uh, yes, please. Well, I mean, uh, did Weller. someone go wired for it? Weller has, yeah. Okay. So you keep an eye on him. Looks like you got a wee bit of bump there. I'll clean that up. Taking care of. And in the meantime, just so you're not jumping up and getting any ideas. You're with us there, bud. All right, well, let's get to hear that you're breathing. Howdy. You're uh, Anne Valentine in the medical office. We're getting a medic for you. Looks like you have taken a gunshot. Got that packed up. We don't want you to <clears throat> die from that, of course. Not pleasant being shot, as you know, I got shot last night. Oh, fuck. Liam stepped a minute, so nice to meet you. Do you know who oh, you are? Mitchell. Hey, Deputy Mitchell. Whoa, hey! Mitchell? Just, uh, just, just so take it easy, alright? Is that, is that yeah. Toby? Wait. I'm here to get him out. Yeah. I'm gonna need you to you just, Can you just put the gun first. down and back away? How is he? He's, oh, I'm boy. getting him medical care right now. Put the gun down. I'm taking him, I'm taking Don't him. Don't do that, fella. I'd do it if you know what's good for you. Right, you've got two guns on you. Oh. One behind and one... Put your gun down immediately. Oh, Come on, Toby. Toby. I want one of you all to put him on the back of my horse and I want to ride out Toby, Toby, let me explain something to you real quickly, okay? What? All right. This is a... We <laughs> have nothing on you. Well, I was going to come in here. I was going to lecture Nate. I was going to send him on his way. But you doing this gives a full... <laughs> I mean, come on, man. Look what you're doing right now. Think about your actions, sorry. It was gonna be a moonshine. It was gonna be a moonshine charge want, that's not that severe. Oh, one of you to just put him on the back of my horse and I want to ride out of town. That's all. And there won't nah. have to be anything for In this. his current state, he needs medical. Mate. What's you're wrong You're gonna risk him? He's been shot! Who shot him? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Toby, put down the gun. Why don't you listen to it? Why don't you listen to Put down the gun. Toby, get out of here. I ain't leaving you. Toby, then don't leave him. Just put down the weapon. <sighs> Just put it down. Put it down. All right? This only ends in two ways. Yo, I want the fucking best doctors on him. I want the fucking we best doctors. We are working to get the doctors the for him. They're on their way. I'm in here taking don't care play. of him. Where are you going, Toby? Can she continue to take care of him? All right. Just place your hands up, please. You're going to be in cuffs. All right. You... Just get him help. I do not. My handcuffs are not working. I got him. Yeah. Okay. I got him. Ah, fuck no. 
All right. Where's he been shot? What's happening? He's shot in his shoulder. We're waiting on the doctor. We've already sent for them. His wound is packed. Let's tend to his, to his head. My ankle's still a bit tender if you want to help me move him. All right, Toby. Look, he's going to get the best care. We sent for doctors. There's plenty around. All right? We took care of him as soon as he had any injuries. Why'd you all shoot him? him? What happened? Out. We don't, I don't know. I wasn't there, but why don't you come to the Who? side with me? Can't you just leave me here? I want to make sure he gets the att fucking medical attention he needs. I can promise you and that Toby? he's going to get the medical attention that he needs. Never lied to you. I've never lied to you. I'm telling you, he's going to get the best medical attention. All right. If he fucking if he dies on that table, I swear to God. Don't start making. Don't be threats. making threats. I, right, I, I, I don't think that's a threat now. I think I'm just I'm moment. just questioning him so yeah. that he doesn't get himself yeah. in more trouble than he's already generating right here. Come on, Toby. Okay, we're sympathetic with the fact that he cares about his friend, but we can't go pointing at peep guns at people for that. Just yeah. just get him help. Wait. I'll stay here. His pulse is strong. Hello? Oh. Howdy. Alright, you're here just in time. He's got a GSW uh. to the shoulder. He's got a large bump in his head which I've cleaned up. The, the wound in the shoulder is packed but it's starting to bleed through the guts. He was okay. conscious a moment ago, but he started, uh, he, he passed out again. Alright. Uh, since you're, I can take care of this since, uh, you've been working a hard day. Alright, you want to take it? Yeah. Alright. Um, can you just check his head for me, actually? Mm -hmm. Just to make that sure is, there. That is one of the reasons why we need to make sure that we bring people like this directly into the office, not into the doctor's. Not saying you did or anything, just <laughs> that's why. Uh, believe me, <laughs> I, I would have. I thought it was, I started walking into the office. That's what I thought he was. No, I didn't. I can't, I can't even remember who brought me there. But I'm gonna go make sure that they're okay in there. I'll uh, keep watching in here. Yeah, he's got an artery. Okay. All right. Let me know if you need me to do anything. Uh, I do oh, not think shit. so, and I really hope they don't, Jinji. <laughs> There's a good chance if it's an artery, you might want me to do the quarantine before you. Uh... In case he starts to bleed a lot. Yeah, if you want to. Alright. The head injury I think is less concerning. Oh. You need any assistance? Uh, not at the moment, I don't think. Mm hmm okay. Then we don't get foreigners to check because you're awful.
Here, let me do this so it'll help you while you work. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Alright, looks like it's holding good. Alright, I'll get these out of your way. It's Nate Casey. He just looks kind of like Jack because right, he's take that <laughs> Sorry, I thought you were taking the clamps. No, it's okay. No, I'll take, I'll take it all. Just give it all to me. It's Toby and um, Nate. They're friends. Right. They do crime together. He was uh, shot in the shoulder. With you asking? Nope, I'm just uh. Oh, okay. It was hard to tell with the inflection in your voice. That's okay. Hey. My goodness, it's a wild motto. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, wow, there's a horse shoving his head through the window. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, 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 I didn't know there were people here already. And... Oh no, he's okay. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, yes, sorry. Hello again. We, we, there we it is. Quite literally, we're coming into town and then happened upon this. The nurse came running out to tell us. Oh. Go ahead and um, stand over there. That way you can observe. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. So we're gonna pull it out. We search it up an artery. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If there's anything else wrong here? Because nothing else is happening and they all showed up. I feel like I want to feed these horse carrots out the window. <laughs> is that Macho's horse? I'm not sure he is. Stop, stop, stop this. Stop. <laughs> he's, he's peeping. I'm just mm -hmm. going to reach in and pull my hat off my head and take it out the window. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's going to reach in and take this fella's boot. My goodness. Mm. I'm sorry about that. Oh, you're fine. You're fine. I was just jesting about the horse peeking in the window. Some of this here.
Why is it so awkward? It's just, it's just medical RP. I'm Anything boring. I can do in here? Uh, just waiting for them to be able to get him up and then we can transfer him over to the cells and have a discussion with him. Uh, uh, do you know who this already. is? That's uh, Nate Casey. Nate Casey, alright. Thank you. They're getting you fixed up, Nate. Uh. <laughs> Toby's waiting in the cells for you. Diamond Topi. I really. <laughs> I know he cares for you, but. I mean, doing a jailbreak over something like Moonshine. Not very All right, smart. Alright, here we go. Alright. Hmm. Alright, Toby. Move towards me just a wee bit. I'll help support you, and I'll need you. Put your hands up. Alright, let's move. Let's come on over. Uh, oh, first, thank you. Uh, uh, yeah, of course. Uh, here. Go over to you. I'll continue my efforts. I'm trying to go. Bella, come back. Somewhere. Quit running away from me. <laughs> I'm sorry. Here I come. Hello. Oh, okay, yes, I'll pass this along. Appreciate it. Mm. Alright, Nate. Here we go. Alright, you wanna take him? I haven't, I haven't yeah. searched him yet, so... I'll take it over. Thank you, thank you. Mm -hmm. possession. Uh, no. Not in your bank, not in your... I don't know, hidden chest in a, in a bush somewhere or something. No. You sure about that? 100% sure. You swear to me. Well, Dude, Michael will be back, back tomorrow. Like, honestly... Yeah, but you don't have anything that you could hand into us, per se, to... I don't know, show that you're capable of working with us? Wow, I, Mr. I Casey. I, I, I'll go check my telegrams. I, I couldn't even count all those bills that you got stuck up everywhere. Oh, you should look at what my bank hell? account.
No, game. Uh-oh. 